Who still uses auxiliary cable in 2024? Well, I'm one. You cannot see it much in the market these days, and when it goes bad, I try to fix it myself. So this one was having a partial contact, and I use it for all my some of my earphones and some other auxiliary connection. Uh, when I opened it, I was like, okay, I'm just gonna need to solder one thing here, and it to be fine. Uh, but was it? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I pulled out my soldering iron, you know, cleared it with a little bit of coil, then so that one, and while I was soldering this one, I discovered that the other one is also out. I was like, oh man, I'm going to need to bring all of them out, you know, keep the cable sharp and start soldering it all again. Welcome to our last fix it for 2023 and it's bringing us to 2024. So to begin to solder the cable after cleaning the wires, I have to put it somewhere that will be stable. This is one of the most difficult things to do when you're soldering <laughs> these micro solderings. And um, yeah, clean the cables, get fresh lead and then start soldering. Yeah. So make sure that the contacts are clean and make sure that your cable connection are the way it is. And then after everything, I'm just going to open up and then test it with a multimeter. Okay, the first one went through. That's the negative. I tried the next one, which is the right audio. It, it was, you know, going on. Uh, but finally, I tried the next audio now, which is the left audio. And it wasn't really, really giving me a uh, continuity test. I, I could see reading some resistance, now, which means it could talk, but that would not work properly. So yeah, the little fix has turned to a bigger, bigger fix. Well, I have to go back now and check the contact. I want to know whether this plug, because I love this golden one, you know, <laughs> it's more solid than the other edge. Uh, I was like, I tested the plugs, yeah. Uh, I discovered that the plug is still working well, the contact for the left audio, right audio, and then the ground or the negative is still working. Then the next thing I have to do is like, I have to check the wire itself because sometimes in this auxiliary cable, this is an old cable. As a matter of fact, <laughs> I've changed the two heads over. So let me check whether this cable is bad. Yeah, from the test, I can see that the cables are all working. Ah, just a little soldering now is going to turn to a very, very huge work. Of course, I'm going to try to, you know, solder all the wire, you know, make it look good and, you know, cut it off short to be sure that everything is okay. Yeah, now I'm going to again start to solder it properly. Now I'm going to run some tests to see whether my soldering is working. I'm going to run, check whether there is partial contact anywhere. So the right audio is working, it's not touching the left. I'm going to go to the ground on, on negative, and then it's still working. Then, yeah. So um, I'm <laughs> once I've confirmed that all of them are working, I'm going to put an insulator between the negative and the positive contact to make sure that when you're closing it, you know, it doesn't touch. So putting that, I'm also going to use another insulator because this type of plug doesn't come with insulator. The other end has its own insulator. And the next thing that you have to do always is to lock the head. The head of this one is very strong. So use a plier, lock it up and yeah, we'll definitely be good to go. And when I'm done, I'm going to now use, since the cover is metal, I'm going to use another insulator to seal it up and then we are almost good to go. Yeah, there is it, but yeah, I still have to test it again because <laughs> these cables can be troublesome. So the negative works, and that's also the ground. Then we're going to look whether there is partial contact, anyone touching each other when you close it, um, none. So let's move in and test the right audio or the right channel. Yeah, the right channel works. And then let's finally test the um, left audio channel. It works. So yeah, that's about that. But for some of you who are doubting Tomosis, I'm going to play music here and connect it. Yeah, as you can see, it's connected. And I'm going to try to bring the speaker close. So yeah, it is working. It's still working in 2024. That's what I'm going to be using to edit some of this video. And that's what I'm using to edit this video. So make sure you like, subscribe, and welcome to Wonderful 2024. Subscribe. I see.